little tip for you, Ben, and all the Golf Shop Online uh, watchers and buyers and customers. Par threes, we are rubbish at par threes. That pin is front left, which is a friendly pin, but I'm still going to ignore it. I'm just going to go pretty much middle of the screen. Right. Scoring average on par threes, believe it or not, even for the best players in the world, is over par. Is it? It's like 0 0.01 or something, it moves, but even the top 50 in the world average over the par on par threes. Handicap golfers, they struggle. Getting the ball on near the green. Do not fall for pins on par threes of all the pins in all the world. Don't get sucked in. Now, the only other caveat I'll add to this, which is an interesting one, is that bunker short right is death. And it doesn't matter if it's that bunker or other one. So on this par three, I'm middle of the green, but that does push me a bit more towards that bunker, which you don't want to go in as an amateur. Amateurs are so bad out of bunkers. So I'm now looking at that, going to move towards my the pin, but I'm ignoring that it's at the front, I'm going middle, because okay. if I hit the banks on the left, it's kicking in. If I hit the bunker on the right, I'm making bogey and most amateurs are as well. Miss bogeys at all, uh, miss bunkers at all costs and move that pin in your head, definitely on the par threes. And I've done that little pull, it's gonna just kick off those banks. Ah, uh, oh. sit, sit, sit. Like that's so much better than the shot I hit. You hit that shot on the range, you'd be disappointed. Yeah. But the result, because my planning was good, yes please.